everyone, Nozzle the Hedgehog here, and welcome to uh, more trails. Um, I do have someone here, so sign in. I am a serpent just signing in. <laughs> <laughs> and for those who are surprised uh i'm in my halloween costume right now because uh by the time you guys see this uh it'll be october so <laughs> yeah it took me it took me a while to finish up persona so we're pretty much in spooky season it right now if we're talking about uh uh viewer wise Let's go. Oh, how I love Halloween. Right. How have you been anyway? Still no luck getting back home, I'm guessing. No. Uh. Well, that's unfortunate. Oh well, yeah, I forgot because we haven't done this in a while. Um, we're trying to finish up a a um, what is that called? A uh, trial that that Emma's grandmother uh, is putting us through. So I'm guessing this fight's gonna have a this part's gonna have a lot of fighting. Because we're going to have to go through the um, trial. But yeah, I haven't, I haven't, I haven't came back to this, um, for a while. I've been, uh, exploring other universes, actually. I've, uh, I explored an area, a universe called Ratchet and Clank. Uh, one called Freedom Planet. <laughs> So, so, yeah. Oh! We have to fight her? Oh, no! Oh, my. She's quite strong. Because, again, we've played as her in the third game. So, yeah, she's quite strong and powerful. And they want us to fight her. Oh, no.
Oh, yeah, one universe that keeps popping up is the Zenless Zone Zero um, universe. That one keeps uh, popping up, and uh, a lot of issues keep happening in that universe. So I'm constantly having to go back. Constantly having to go back um, into that one. I don't know how, for how long, though, but it, it might be a might be a while before I finish that one. But yeah, uh, random ones keep popping, um, random portals keep popping up. No thanks. We didn't... I did nothing! Oh, oh good lord. This is not gonna be an easy fight. Because we're hardly doing damage to her. thing you missed. Oof. Let's go. Roaring winds. Sweep them away. Oh. Alright, so she's doing... So Laura's doing the the most damage right now. Oh no, she just healed herself! Oh no! I hate bosses that do that. Okay, are you going to do the ultimate? Okay, so... Oh, good thing... Oh, no! Oh no! Jeez. <laughs> hmm. 
You allergic to pumpkin, I'm guessing? Pumpkin, yo. Oh, that'd be absurd. There's pumpkin everywhere where I come from. Oh, boy. So I'm guessing you're from a pumpkin patch, I'm guessing. All yours. Leave it to me. I'm flattened down under. I appreciate it. Leave it to me. Yeah, well, that doesn't have uh, pumpkins everywhere. This time of year, they're pretty really scattered. Hmm. It's my turn. Crimson Slash. Show me if you would stand this. So, do you do the normal Halloween protocol? How does that work down there? Huh? It's my turn. There. Like scared. Where we get the most scared? It's hard to say. Hmm. I'm guessing it's a lot harder to do down there. <laughs> Dodge that. We took her down. Are you all right? Yeah, I need to keep getting better. Yeah. I must continue to train. That's how it's done. Eh, why did he have to? Oh. As soon as we can remove him, I'm going to. Ugh. Yeah, I don't like crow. How can everyone just teleport out?
I don't get that. But I've noticed that everyone in, in this universe, and I've been noticing ever since the second game, that everyone can teleport out. Mm. Yeah, like after you f you beat them in a fight, that they'll just teleport out. And I've started to notice that after um, after the second game, it's like like how how can people just teleport out? It's my turn. It doesn't make no sense. I mean, to my knowledge, only, I mean, am I, I understand because, you know, she's a witch and everything, but everyone else, I don't get how they can teleport out. What? Respected meteor. So crystal clear. So this is what the wandering witches spent so many generations watching over. Oh, I see. It's actually an artifact, isn't it? For real? An artifact? It does emanate a certain aura, not unlike that of the Bell of Pasta. Very astute. That particular artifact was passed down through the course of. It is but one of many. The tetracyclic towers of Laveau, the recluse cube of the Liberoth, the black records of the Arnor family, even Prince Oliver's sonorous seashell. Legend says Adios bestowed artifacts to a number of different groups back in the days of yore. Which would mean this mirror was the artifact consigned to the witches. Correct. The spectral moon mirror. Wow, so. A lot of ancient artifacts. It is also the source of the many visions you have experienced. <laughs> because of the Nevertheless, it is quite a rarity for its powers to manifest, even for us witches. But everything changed the moment we congregated together in the shrine. Emma, the wandering witch, and Selene are familiar. Schmorzer, the Cursed Sacrifice, and I, the Elder of the Hexagon. The Great Twilight is upon us, and a frenzied thirst for blood sweeps over the land. So not even the witches can see all these visions really all the time? The true ancestor of the vampires. <laughs> the term vampire is little more than slander. A myth that masks the reality of my kin. Wow. Although, when it comes to manipulating vitality, I suppose there is a hint of truth to the tales. What? Ooh. What? Years ago, 
It fused with the King of Fire's elder to prevent a great calamity of their time. This creature was the holy beast sent forth by the goddess, the Burning Sphinx. The bur The Burning Sphinx. Oh. So you're the one the church has been searching for. Another holy beast. Long thoughts were. Oh, shoot. As I have already stated, I am not the first to bear the name Rosetta. What? The original disappeared 900 years ago. The due to the gnomes betrayal. I began my existence as a familiar, not unlike Selene. What? My predecessor showed me this telling me to return here should anything happen. I obeyed, and when I arrived... So originally she was a familiar to someone else. As well as her mission. Thus did I become the second Roselia. She's the second? Come to think of it, that bird beauty used to own of azure wings just like that. So both familiars were made in the image of the holy beast that created them. Now I understand why you wanted Selene to come here. Indeed. The great twilight is upon us, and our clash with the gnomes draws ever closer. Okay. In the state of the world and the coming of the rivalries, nothing is guaranteed. Right. As such, should the worst come to pass, Selene is to serve as my successor. What? If something happens to Rose, Celine has to become that? Oh, shoot! Filling the air with strife will cause the reflecting pool to show its vision's feet to the black records. Okay. Yeah, I feel about this. The ultimate sacrifice here should allow us to see the truth of this curse in its entirety. But let me guess, we gotta get through you first. Only pieces. So we're really going to fight you without holding anything back. Precisely. Now, enough dogling. Okay, so we have to fight her in order to get access to the full vision that we only got to see pieces of. Oh boy. We just got a lot of lore dumped on us. Gee, yeah. so she's so big that she takes up the whole screen. Activate. 
Let's see, can we actually take her down? Oh, I hate the confused thing. Oh no, all four of us are confused. Is this an unwinnable battle? Switch you. I'll handle this. As your yeah. Okay, that still didn't do any damage. I mean, we just got a bunch of lore dumped onto us, but now we have to fight her to... Oh, boy. And she's... We're only doing very little damage to her. Uh, that did nothing. <sighs> I hate when they do these, uh, confusion. Uh, My knowledge, there is no item. There's no item to cure the the confusion. Unlike in Persona. We're switching. Switch with me. Leave it to me. Now. 
All right, boost. Let's go. That still didn't do nothing. Gee, she's got a lot of HP. This fight is long. I'm not sure if this is how you know, if uh, if we were higher, if uh, this fight would take us long, <laughs> this long or not. Like, is this like the normal... Does people normally struggle this much on this fight? <laughs> yeah, or is it just me? <laughs> Beans, but the mystery. Right. We're only halfway with her health. She better not have the ability to heal herself, otherwise, oh. You serious all that time? <clears throat> Very well. Oh, good lord. Oh no! If I knew that this fight was going to take this long, I would have saved it for... What? I would have saved it for next time. But we're already committed and almost done with it, so... <sighs> Yeah, let's heal everyone up. Because if she does that fire move again, we might end up losing. Uh, I'm 
Unfortunately, we had to heal him. Yeah, go into your ogre form. Jeez. She's got a lot of health. Well, at least Celine's helping with uh, letting us do our all-out attacks. Even though that it might not be useful. Oh, jeez, Rain's angry. I kind of agree there, Reen. <laughs> this fight's taking way too long. Let's, go. Let's see what you can do. Ooh, that did a lot of damage. Let's go, Alyssa. Let's go! Oh, he's gonna use our Dean! Let's see. Oh! Alright, Selene, what are you gonna do? Let's see. Hmm. Just normal fire, okay. And how fitting! Selene took it down. When everyone leveled up. Oh, even, uh, even Master Courts are being leveled up. Next time we'll find out what happens um, with um, <laughs> we'll find out what happens next time with the um, after we uh, you know since we we beat her and uh, and all that um, so why don't you uh, why don't you sign off? Yes, this is uh, Pentius signing off. And this is Nazo the Hedgehog signing off. Thank you guys again for watching. Make sure you comment, rate, subscribe, turn on notifications so you don't miss a video from me. And I will see you guys next time. Mm. Goodbye, everyone. Well, well, well. <laughs> uh, took me quite a while to f 
finally get my message across. <sighs> Hello. For those who don't remember me, it's me, Nazo. The real Nazo. <laughs> the one that you've been seeing all this time is a fake. But don't you worry. Soon I will actually be able to come back and take my rightful place as Nazo once again. <laughs> Until then, see you guys next time.